Last Wednesday morning, on the 24th, I went for my usual morning walk down by the Claddagh. It was a nice sunny morning, and in the middle of the channel between the Claddagh Pier and uh, the Long Walk, there was an otter fishing uh, in the water, bobbing up and down. It would disappear underwater for a few minutes and come back up with some small thing that it was chewing on and eating. At one point, while watching the middle of the channel for the otter to resurface, I noticed something out of the corner of my eye over at the boat ramp. The otter had swam about 30 or 40 metres underwater and had come up under a seagull and grabbed it and killed it. This still image was taken a second or two after I noticed the commotion. The gull only struggled for a second or two, though the otter pulled it under the water several times in quick succession uh, as if to drown it and finish it off. It looked like it, its neck had been broken in the initial attack. Having made sure of its kill, the otter then proceeded to drag the gull downstream, uh, down towards Galway docks where there was a spot it could lift it out of the water and eat it. To be honest, if I hadn't actually seen the otter make the kill, I might have presumed that if I saw an otter dragging along a dead seagull, that it had just found it and it was just scavenging. It seemed to me the way the otter made the kill that it wasn't the first time it did it. It very clearly went straight for the neck, dragged it down, had broken the bird's neck within a second or two. Though I did make sure of the job by pulling the bird under a couple of times to drown it, the bird was making no resistance at that point, it was already dead. I've noticed before that swans do not like otters swimming around or underneath them. Earlier, all the swans had swam out of the way of the otter as it made its way up the carp uh, towards the cladder. Obviously, if a, an otter can take a gull, it can take a duck, and it can certainly take a cygnet, and presumably the swans know that. If you found the video interesting, uh, give it a like, and if you have any questions, uh, leave them in the comments below, and I'll try and answer them. Thank you.